Hey guys, it's your girl Lami here again, bringing you another celebrity gist. Make sure you stick around to the end and don't forget to click that subscribe button on your right. So there's this rumor going around that Mercy Johnson has put to bed, which her husband later came out of the bunk. But before her husband debunked the news, so many people have gone to their Instagram page to wish them congratulations on the birth of their newborn. So many congratulatory messages, so many heartwarming messages. But one message caught the eyes of many and that's the message from Davido. Davido tagged the couple wicked people. Why did Davido call them wicked people? We will get into that shortly. But before we go into that, let's take a look at Osh Puppy's latest achievement. So Hush Puppy is not one to complain about financial constraints this lockdown period at all because he just got for himself what he tagged his new baby. He posted a picture of a Rolls Royce Cooling Nan 2020 model which is worth 127.8 million naira and he captioned the post, my baby boo has arrived. We all know that when it comes to luxury life, expensive gadgets, automobiles and all that, Rayosh Poppy is certainly one who never misses out on such opportunities. So his latest addition to his collections is this new car. You don't come home. Go do anybody there. Yes. So precisely on Sunday, news started going around that Mercy Johnson has given birth to their fourth child. So many people took to Instagram to congratulate the couple on the birth of the newborn. Some of our colleagues even reposted the picture on their pages of her in the hospital with the newborn baby, which we later discovered that it was a picture from the previous child, the birth of the previous child. Rumor which Mercy Johnson's husband has since debunked. He went on his Instagram page and posted, I woke up this morning to see countless missed calls and messages congratulating me on the arrival of our new baby. We are so thankful for the show of love. But my wife at Mercy Johnson Okoje has not put to bed yet. It's a good news and I will certainly update you all when it happens. Thank you and God bless. So Mercy Johnson too took to her Instagram page and posted a picture of herself showing her pregnancy belly with her family. She captioned the picture, a quiet Sunday with my love at Prince Odi Okoje. Apparently, she was trying to let us see her belly that she was still very much pregnant and she has not put to bed like people are saying. So one of her colleagues that went on the internet to congratulate her was Eniola Badmos. Eniola Badmos posted on her Instagram page the picture of the couple holding the baby, the supposed newborn baby which we later discovered was a previous child. So she wrote under the picture, she captioned the picture, congratulations to my people, our baby is here. So under that congratulatory message people started commenting so many comments so many congratulatory comments so many heartwarming wishes to them so one of such people that came out to congratulate them was davido so davido commented that wicked people congratulations though i'm sure many people are wondering what did the couple do to davido to deserve this kind of comment it all started few months back when mercy johnson and her husband opened their new hotel 
They paid Davido the sum of 3 million naira to perform at the opening ceremony, which Davido never turned up at the event. And this got Mercy and her husband angry, so they dragged Davido out on social media and also promptly sued him for not performing as agreed at the opening of their Ennod Luxury Hotel in Nabuli Egba, Lagos. Initially, Davido ignored them, he didn't respond to them. But later, he took to his Twitter to explain why he didn't show up at the event. He said he had been warned not to come to such an environment because it was risky. But the question everybody asked then was, when you know you can't come to such an environment because of the risk involved, why did you collect their money? Or perhaps if you had collected the money before realizing the environment was not a good one to go to, why don't you let them know on time and return their money so they can look for alternative on time before the event comes up? Well, if all what we had happened between the Okojiers and Davido was what really happened, I don't think it is enough reason for Davido to come out and tag them wicked people. I mean, I see it as just a business deal gone wrong and it's something that can be resolved between them amicably. So I feel Davido ought to have explained to them before that day why he won't be able to make it to the event and maybe reach agreement with them and re refund their money to them. But this he didn't do. He allowed the event pass. Those people were at their event waiting for him to come and they did not see him. And they got angry and dragged him on the internet. So that was the reason why Davido went to their last page to tag them wicked people. Once Zini asked Davido, what did them do? Davido simply responded saying, nothing, just evil set of people. That's all. conversation between father dmw and michael blackson how did you figure out how old you are first yeah i'll take my own 19 years how did you check huh? how did you find out i come by my my, 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 tell my mommy and tell my grandpapa and tell my grandmama my grandmama took it to my father my father took it to my mommy my mommy call me my mommy call me my sister call me my phone my brother called me. They are telling me, now you are a where you're 19. Anybody call you and tell you are a 21 is a liar. Ni is your brother. She is your sister. So nobody can tell you where you never tell you. You are here 19 years. They born you February 1 in London. Are you still a virgin or you get some pussy in, in Tanzania? I'm I'm still a virgin. I'm not see, see my mouth is clean. I'm not I'm not I'm not drinking anything. I'm fasting. Okay. I'm fasting. I'm not looking woman. I'm not looking my phone too much. I'm not pressing my phone. I, I just yesterday I just get my phone back. Is my phone is not with me. I'm not like touching phone too much because fasting is the big thing. Fasting you don't want anything about woman. Don't see your close your eyes. When you gonna get married so you will have sex? Because I think that's what you're missing in your life. Yeah, like ten years ago. Huh? Like 10 years ago, boss. 10 years ago, what? I want to marry 10 years ago. What do you mean ago? You mean 10 years from now? Yeah. Why you say ago? Like 10 years ago is... is because my fast. English is pure pure English. It's not like broken. That's not pure English. It's pure English. I'm not speaking PG. So 10 years, 10 years ago means present or past. Ten years ago, I mean, it come. It come already. Yeah, it come already. You wanna come? Like you wanna come? You know it's gone, so you wanna come? Yeah, you wanna come? You gone gone. <laughs> Ten years ago, me is gone. Now it's coming. Oh, you mean gone? No, I mean, what did you mean? I mean, ten years ago. 
10 years ago, it's gone, right? <laughs> oh, yeah, it's gone. Yeah, but you want to get married 10 years ago? Yeah. So you got married already? Yeah. You married uh, 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 when you were... I want to marry. When? 10 years ago. <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious. Papsi. Papsi, I'm serious. Daddy, I'm serious. 10 years ago, it's in the past, man. It's over. Have you, have you get married? I was married 21 years ago. Wow. Huh. And I got divorced a long time. Wow. Ago. Huh. I want to get married again, maybe four years from now. Uh -uh. Not four years ago. From years from now, not uh -huh. ago. What's and we what? Like I'm listening. You are busting my head. So like you have married since. Yeah, since before you was born, cause you're nineteen, right? Yeah, I'm nineteen. What year you was born? I was born in February. What year? In twenty. I don't forget. You don't remember or you don't forget? I don't forget. I don't remember. If I remember, I need to carry papers. You don't know what year you was born? They told you your yeah. age. They didn't tell you the year you was born? Yeah, I need to. I, I, I don't remember all this one because you have I'm, to not, ask. A, you have I'm to not a ask. village boy. So I didn't know this ones. Who you have to ask to find out when you was born? I need to call my dad or my senior brother to ask him how old am I? Hey, sorry, which year I born? I'm coming, sorry. Hello. You didn't even dial no number. You just picked up the phone. No, I'm just I'm 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 just kidding on the phone. Are you in a hotel? I'm in my room. Hello. What's up? Where you are? You are in Cali. Where's mom? Go go punish you. Why did why did you leave mom for us? Can you fucking go back to home? Please, right now. Wait. Which year them bomb me? February 1? Okay. February 1. What What year? 2000... Mm, 2000... Well, um, he said he didn't know. He said he didn't know that one. I said... Hey, 2000... <laughs> 2001. 